All right, here's a walkthrough of But God by Village Church. This is in D sharp minor. We have written out sheet music for it because we couldn't find it online. Uh, the main feature of this is a piano with a dotted eighth delay on it, which takes care of a lot of the heavy lifting in the signature lick for you. All right, so I'll walk through the chords later. Uh, I'm just going to demonstrate the whole song uh, after I finish talking through the patch. Want to make sure that we set the tempo to the tempo of the song, which uh, I think is going to be about 80 BPM plus or minus. There's also a pad layered in here. And uh, the cutoff knob will affect that. So if later in the song you feel like you need to brighten things up, you can do that. Also, if you feel like you just want to dry it out completely, you can do that. Uh, but it's pre-programmed at approximately zero, so uh, that's in there for you. Again, if you're a non-CTIer and you're watching this video and trying to figure out how to do that, um, on your keyboard, you just want a piano patch that's going to go through a dotted eighth delay and set the wet dry. As you want to hear it and if you want to layer a pad under it you can but you could recreate this on any keyboard so D sharp minor is kind of a uh, stinky key if you will good luck to you I will probably flub some notes in this demo because uh, sheet music is not my forte and neither is D sharp minor but we're gonna give it a, a good shot and then I will come back and walk you through what I'm doing uh, and I'm not gonna do this with the music I'm just gonna I mean with the track I'm just gonna play it uh, all right, here we go. That's your intro. Here's verse one. one again here's your chorus but Different chords coming up. Especially different because I'm going to mess them up. Uh, I'm going to take it from the top of that phrase again. Second chorus. But God. Quarter pulse in left hand. Tacit for the first four bars here. In glorious light, Jesus, Savior King. We were called. One, five, one in the right hand. Just you. Mm -hmm. 
in. Break. section is an ad lib outro which you are out for so you can use either cut off or volume to fade that sustaining pad out while the acoustic guitar and vocal and uh, keys too with a pad take the rest of it all right a couple of quick hints about each element uh, first of all just spelling those crazy chords at the top for you um, and I'm not going to talk about them in the key of D sharp because nobody wants to talk about an E sharp so I'm just going to use sensible language um, your right hand, it's an F sharp, G sharp, C sharp. Uh, the next one is a C sharp, F sharp, G sharp. And then the last one is a G sharp, C sharp, F sharp. So let me turn the delay off. That's what you're doing with your right hand. Uh, your left hand, uh, just put yourself in this G sharp minor triad position and stay married to that. So uh, five, three, and then a open fifth. And then that little kick in the middle is just C sharp F, and it's in uh, two, three, ba da. Two, three, ba ba. And the delay takes care of the rest of it for you. That's your intro, just watch, and your verses. Watch for the altered chord, uh, the second half of verse one on the uh, line, O oh, have asked the void of love, the darkness of despair, my hell bound home assured. Those are different. And then when you get to verse two, O oh, how vast the love of God, and still my soul it wars against the power of dark. So the words there are the darkness of despair, and still my soul it wars. And the chords are not the same in verse one and verse two. So just watch for that subtlety. Uh, I think the choruses are pretty straightforward. You're doing kind of long held whole note stuff of the first one and the breakdown. After that, you can get into this quarter pulsing kind of thing. Uh, and then the interludes and, and uh, outro and tag are all just kind of block chords. So there's really, you know, just three or four repeating patterns that you can have some variations of. Uh, and once you get used to the key of D sharp minor, uh, it shouldn't be too difficult. So good luck to you.